Superheroes are everywhere in American pop culture. We recognize them by the capes on their backs and the logos on their chests. So how might we turn a superhero's costume into an opportunity for students to develop critical thinking skills? I'm Dan Ryder, and this is AE Comics VX. Hi everyone, I'm Dan Ryder, co-creator of Panels and Perspectives, and welcome to AE Comics VX. For many of us, the clothes on our backs express our personalities, our values, and our beliefs. Well, the same is true for a superhero's costume. A superhero's costume helps tell the story of what that character represents and what the ideals are that that character wants to bring into the world. Today on AE Comics VX, we're going to take a closer look at masks and capes, tights and tool belts, and explore how designing superhero costumes can provide an opportunity for students to think about critical thinking and also their visual and communication skills. So let's get started. Designing superhero costumes can be a lot of fun, but it also requires a lot of thoughtful consideration about intentions. Is your character going to wear a mask? And why would they need to conceal their identity? Is your character going to wear a cape? Is it there to intimidate? Or is it there to inspire? Why would a character be wearing tights? What kind of tools and equipment might they use? And the logos and symbols that represent superheroes should be both simple and easy to recognize, but also represents something about that character. When we ask our students to think about why our superheroes wear masks and symbols, we invite them to think about much more than just the action on the page. 